619 right now. Hey, when you think of local animal rescue groups, maybe you think of dogs, cats, even horses first. Exotic bird rescue might not jump out as a growing need, but a Jupiter Farms couple is on a mission to show you that it is and they need your help. I interviewed them and learned a lot and I hope you do too. To Susan Otto, there's no pecking order for the birds she cares for. He likes to get on my head. <laughs> what are you doing, Chopper? I know. Let me go back on the cage. The 30 plus exotic birds at her house are all rescues and looking for a home. But to her, they're like family. I raised her from a baby, so she thinks she's my baby. Can I have a kiss? Give me a kiss. Oh, thank you. A year ago, Susan and her husband moved to Jupiter Farms and created this, a growing bird sanctuary, a seven day a week labor of love. How do you feel with your noise? Are you okay with that? Well, I can get used to it after now, and sometimes people say, oh my God, how can you stand the noise? And I'm like, what noise? And just walking around her house, you learn so much, like which ones talk, which ones dance and how long they live. Unless you have a tortoise, you're not going to have anything else that lives as long as your bird. Yeah, some of these guys live up to 80 years. It puts some families in a bind, so in steps the autos, rescuing the birds, then housing them and adopting them out. It's very hard for me to let a lot of them go because we don't always know how they're going to be cared for. You know, we hope for the best. And their footprint is already growing. They took in these baby Quaker birds found in Palm Beach County, and when this African hornbill was on the loose in Boynton Beach, the autos helped get it to the proper wildlife rescue resource. You'd be shocked at how many birds are out there that need help and how many people are out there that need help with their birds. Palm Beach Parrot Rescue is expanding to other animals other than birds. Horses, tortoises, rabbits, guinea pigs, and who knows what else. And they're looking for volunteers to help this two-person operation take flight. She loves her mommy. Yes, she does. Right, Palm Beach Parrot Rescue is a registered nonprofit, also registered with Florida Fish and Wildlife Volunteers. They can, you can feed, clean, socialize with the birds. If you'd like to help, click the link to the story on our website. When I say I learned a lot, like I didn't know birds could live to 80 years old. That was, <laughs> yeah. blew my mind there. I mean, those birds are so smart, and it's in, just absolutely mind blowing how beautiful and diverse they are with all those colors and gorgeous. Attached to the owners as well. Like when I came in, okay, they kind of, you know, were, were shy, but when she came in, they came over to her, you know, they're crawling and they <laughs> Intelligent. give her a kiss and a peck. She's like, well, they probably want some food as well. Yeah, <laughs> that doesn't <laughs> hurt. A great organization. Cool.